Good afternoon folks, Big Bo here with another great Class A motorhome value from Parkway RV Center. Today got a, one I don't get in very often, I love these, these are great units for the price range. Well built, this is a 2004 Dolphin by National RV. Model number is a 5320, it's 30 feet, 34 feet long bumper to bumper. Uh, these are a very high quality unit and pretty much top of the price range in, in a gas burner in 2004. And they have distinct advantages the way they're built that I'll go over with you that other brands don't have. Uh, you know, it's 34 feet long, it's got 41,000 and some odd miles on it, under 42,000, got less than 200 hours on the generator. Two power slide outs, got the power gear hydraulic jacks. And folks, one word uh, that National has, well, that can describe National and why people, when they were new, spend 25, 30 grand more for a National than they do a Coachman or a Fleetwood or even a Winnebago, and that's Duraframe. This has got that uh, famous all steel Duraframe chassis, just like a Born Free has, not steel and aluminum mixture like other brands use. This is all st steel, subfloor, Roof rafters are steel, the walls are steel, the wall frames, the front and back are steel. Uh, other brands, of course, as many of you know, of course, are aluminum and steel mixture. This is all steel, and that's why one of the main reasons why National rose up to be the number four uh, selling RV manufacturer in the industry when this unit was built in 2004. Of course, it was about $120,000 back in 2004 prices. So this, it's about 20, 25 grand higher than most comfortable, comparable uh, other Class A's, but you got what you paid for. That steel frame is very rigid. It doesn't sway. It's on a workhorse chassis. So you've got the 22 and a half inch tires. You've got the Allison transmission. You've got the um, 8100 Vortec V8, which is the most powerful gas engine you could get in 2004. 340 horsepower, 455 pound-feet of torque, uh, fully enclosed basement, four seasons package. For the for the year RV, it's very well insulated. And I can't stress to you the value of that Duraframe. I mean, if you drove one with the Duraframe and then drove another 2004 model, a different brand that didn't have it, you can tell the difference in about 30 seconds in the way it drives and drives and, and handles the wind and big trucks passing you and things like that. You're really going to appreciate that. Uh, this unit, folks, is um, got a fiberglass roof. These, these come loaded from the factory. Um, it's got a wine guard satellite system. It's got a two-ton uh, basement air conditioner or 24,000 BTU. Doesn't have the air units on top that helps aerodynamics. Less maintenance because you've got one unit to, uh, to maintain instead of two, and you've got the, and it's 40% more efficient, 10% quieter than two rooftop units. So it's going to cool better, be less maintenance over the years, and uh, cool you off quicker. Now I've got it running right now. I've got the air on, 5500 Onan Marquee Gold Generator, under 200 hours on it running perfectly, 5,000 pound hitch on the back. Notice the fiberglass cap, uh, eliminate straight edges. Side of a well-built motor home. Fiberglass roof, so you've got a lot less maintenance. I mean, like I said, folks, it's um, in this year model in price range RV, this is probably one of the top choices. 41,000 miles, no delamination. Uh, that's, of course, your return for your two-ton Coleman basement air. You get the added benefit with that package of having an electric heat pump and you've got a 35,000 BTU furnace as well. So no shortage of ways to heat and cool this RV. Full pass-through storage in the basement. Let's take a look inside. And inside, folks, I mean, you can tell right off the bat, uh, this is well above average quality RV. You've got real DuPont Corian countertops, not the cheap knockoff brand. Got the gold, uh, I don't know how well you can see it right here. 
You know, most other brand manufacturers use a generic brand of Corian countertops. This is the real DuPont Corian. Got the gold, got the uh, gold label on it. Up here in the front, no check engine lights. The backup camera works great. Now I know the camera may jump a little on screen. Um, that's because the refresh rate between my HD camera and the CRT monitor for the backup camera is not compatible. But in real life, folks. When you look at it, the, there's no jumping. It's a perfect, clear picture. You just can't see it on the uh, on the camera with the camera I'm using. Power gear, hydraulic leveling jacks. Got power visors that lower down from the ceiling. It's got a wine guard, uh, auto tracking satellite system, and you can see no check engine lights. Forty-one thousand six hundred and seventy-one miles. Heated power mirrors. Let's see if I can zoom in on those generator hours. 178. Hang on a second here. I may have looked at the one in the seven long. That's actually, I mean, it's still low hours, but that's 720 hours, which, again, folks, that's probably about right for 41,000 miles. Got dual pane insulated windows. It's a very good four seasons unit. Uh, even the passenger side, you've got plug-ins, you've got 12 volt, 12 volt receptacles for the passenger. You've got a slide-out tray right here uh, for food or a laptop or anything. You've got an HD TV upgrade. Let me back this camera off a little bit. You've got the carpeted headliner throughout the entire motor home, and there's no sag in it, no water stains, crown molding. Uh, these are solid maple cabinets. You've got a sleeper sofa that makes a bed. Uh, table booth makes a bed so you can sleep six. And, and you got room here for an air mattress right here in the kitchen if you need to sleep a couple more. Got the factory brochure showing all the specs, options, and all that. It's a model 5320. It's 34 feet long. So it's actually a, a, basically a, a small to small mid-sized uh, motorhome, Class A. At 34 feet you know most class C's are 31 or 32 so for a couple of extra feet you're getting about double the living space of a class C uh, got the nice uh, residential style faucet and sink stovetop got a microwave confection oven this is a space maker confection oven eight cubic foot Dometic There we go. A little spring gets stuck sometimes on those. Uh, Dometic 8 cubic foot refrigerator freezer. It's already getting cold. Now, I haven't had it running very long, so I don't think the fridge is getting to temp yet, but the freezer feels like it's starting to get cold. And we guarantee that stuff anyway, folks. So, I mean, as long as you take the option A price of $39.9, my certified RV techs go through this motor home. We go through an extensive major systems check that will be completed after purchase. And if for some reason the fridge don't work, the air doesn't work, uh, we replace it or repair it. And I got my thermometer here. Let's see. We're blowing 36 degrees out the vents. Notice there's no, I don't see any stains around the vents, which is a sign that they've never kept the filters changed. And it may be cold enough in here for my thermometer to pick up the freezer temp. Let's see. 45. It works, folks. It takes these things, a, a, you know, at least an hour or two to, to actually get down below freezing in the freezer. And, and longer than that, of course, for the fridge to get the temp. Uh, but we do guarantee that. Uh, front seats do swivel for party seating. So you've got your recliner your front seat and you can have eating service for two there eating service for four at the table got all the books and manuals got day night shades in all the windows got the nice edge glass mirror got a walk through bathroom got a sliding privacy door should have a pantry right here yep slide out pantry for all your canned goods and dry goods Step back here, real pretty bathroom. Uh, got the border along the sides there. 
the edge glass shower. You've got the fiberglass surround that goes all the way to the ceiling, uh, which is nice. Uh, you can look around the skylight. There's no sagging, no water stains, anything like that. Uh, I mean, even got the nice residential style uh, shower head and uh, and faucet. Private water closet. Open this up right here. Got a upgrade China Sea Land toilet. Got another vent fan in here. Of course, you've got duct work for your heat. That's always a good thing to see in any enclosed closet in an RV. That way, if you do have your heat on, you're camping up north in the wintertime, you've got your heat on, of course. I mean, you don't want to have one room without heat, especially when it's got plumbing in there. A lot of RV manufacturers kind of forget about that, but National didn't. Got a 60 by 80. This is a Queen Island bed, so it's actually a house size queen. Um, in the slide out is an east west individual reading lamps. Up top, you've got high intensity lights. Got a nice hanging closet right here at the foot of the bed. Got a TV. Um, and you can see how thick the walls are in this thing. I mean, that's probably six inches, maybe even deeper. that air is ice cold feels great because this this is the kind of year here in Georgia it's called we call it clothes changing weather because you come to work you're in long sleeves and, and jeans and a jacket and by about one o'clock you're in short sleeves and uh, shorts so <laughs> gotta love this time of year and it's pretty warm out now so it feels great but anyway folks this unit option a price uh, for those of you who never watched my videos before, we offer you two different options to buy an RV. They're both haggle-free. Option A includes, of course, a nice low-mileage 2004 National Dolphin 5320, uh, Class A with 41,000 miles. Includes a major systems inspection that we go over. Anything we find wrong on that inspection, folks, we fix it before you pick it up, before we deliver it. To keep our overhead down, we don't check units out until we sell them. This allows us to operate with less RV techs. Less RV techs means less people I have to pay. Less people I have to pay means less overhead. Less overhead means lower prices. Allows me to sell motorhomes like this for $39.9. You get an extensive major systems check. It's a worry-free, stress-free option. Uh, you can after it's been through service, you can come pick it up. We'll give you a personal one-on-one -on -one walkthrough with the RV tech that checked it out. He'll go over everything with you, show you how to operate everything, and um, show you what he did to repair any repairs he made. He'll show you. Um, and more. You can videotape him, of course, uh, take notes, however you want to do it. Uh, you also get a year's worth of free camping, up to 21 nights. Uh, up to seven nights at a time at select RV resorts nationwide. Folks, depending on how much you RV, that can actually be worth several hundred dollars alone. Uh, and it's absolutely free. No service charge, nothing like that. Um, and, of course, you get a drive-out tag. You get a, a starter kit with all your RV camping essentials. You do get a um, instructional DVDs. So in case you forget something that, that my tech showed you in the walkthrough, you've got something to kind of fall back on. All that's included, folks, for the haggle-free um, firm price of $39.9. doesn't matter to us if you're paying cash, if you're financing or trading. Of course, all financing with approved credit only and minimum 10% down payment. We've got some great finance sources, folks. There's some big nationwide lenders. Get you long-term. Even though this is a 2004, you can probably go to your credit union. They'll probably go 60 months or six. Or, or a six they'll only go five or six years max, folks. We can probably get you 10, maybe even 12 years uh, through our nationwide lenders who specialize in RVs uh, with approved credit, of course. Now, these things, they're a little trickier than cars to finance. Uh, you know, they're considered a want, not a need. So, you know, if if you have a hard time getting a car financed at a, at a new car dealer or a used car dealer, it's a retail dealer, you may have a little bit difficult time getting an RV financed. Just, just, just not, you know, I don't... Just telling you the truth, folks. But if you can get approved for financing, we'll certainly um, get you the lowest rate we can possibly get you, get you the terms that fit your budget, uh, and, you know, help you out any way you can. You can rest assured 
We do not mark interest rates up. Other RV dealerships, finance departments don't do anything for free, folks. Uh, they mark interest rates up sometimes 2 or 3% over what the bank approves you for, costing you thousands of dollars in higher RV payments over the life of an RV loan. Don't have to worry about that here. And we're also, unlike other dealers, we're more than welcome to work with your own bank or credit union. A lot of other dealers don't like to do that because when you have your own financing, they can't mark the interest rate up and make money. So we don't care who you go through. Uh, you know, we'll help you out every step of the way. Um, you know, we and for those of you who still want some kind of discounted price, even though haggling's kind of a thing of the past anymore thanks to the internet, um, we do offer option B. Option B is saves you time and money, and it saves us time and money that we pass along to you. And option B is you buy the motor home just like we bought it, just like it came in. We did drive it 600 miles, by the way, and did great. Um, you know, my drivers, they, they every time we buy a National with a Duraframe, they kind of try to get into a little argument or they start flipping coins about who's going to drive it because they all want to drive the Duraframe, um, especially towing because they like the way these things tow with that Duraframe with the vehicle behind it. And it did tow a Honda Element all the way back about 600 miles from where we bought it. But anyway, folks, uh, this unit, it's clean, and if you do want the option B price, contact our sales department. They'll be happy to get you a price. Uh, option B, of course, being as is, as it sets, no walkthrough, no demonstration. Um, you know, we strictly sell it to you just like it sets. Uh, you know, you don't get free camping or anything like that. Now, we will, if you let us know you're coming, folks, and, and you make an appointment and be here on time, we will turn the generator on or plug it into power have the air on the fridge on let you do your own inspection of it and then you can decide if you want to do option a or b um, i'll be honest with you folks um you know I, I don't get paid to sell i get paid to do videos uh, my personal opinion of this motor home is i mean i wouldn't hesitate for me and my wife and our six month old daughter to to drive this thing and take it camping and that's my personal opinion of it I, I think very highly of the Nationals. I think they're one of the best built motor homes in this price range that you can buy. They were one of the best built motor homes that you could buy new in 2004. And this one has been well taken care of. I wouldn't hesitate to use it myself, folks. And I'm very picky. <laughs> but anyway, give us a call. I think you're going to love this one it, for the age it is and the price it is. This is one that's not going to last long. I mean, the floors aren't discolored. The carpet looks new. It's The upholstery looks great. I'm not going to say it's pick-proof because I'm sure there's a couple of scratches or dings or dents. It is a 14-year-old motorhome after all. But, you know, you can, you can line up. If you could set it up and line up a 100 2004 National Dolphin and look at every one side by side, this is probably going to be in the top five, maybe even the top three of those hundred dolphins. It does have a sliding door and it looks like it's off the track. Of course, we fixed that. In fact, I'll probably fix that myself after the video. Um, but, you know, folks, like I said, it's definitely one of the nicest ones out there. One of the cleanest ones. Got low miles. You know, uh, you know doesn't have 70, 80,000 miles like a lot of 04s have. Doesn't have a bunch of hours on the generator. Windshield's not cracked, uh, air's ice cold, generator runs great. Come look at it, folks. Um, we're kind of old-fashioned. You know, we do sell about almost 600 used units a year. We sell a couple hundred of those to people we never even meet. And, and while we certainly do our best to accommodate you if that's the way you want to buy, um, I know this is the Internet. You can order pizzas online. You can order cars online. You can order groceries online, so why not order RVs online? Um, and we certainly do our best to accommodate the people that want to buy an RV that way, but we do prefer the old-fashioned way of shaking your hand, getting to know you, and um, letting you see the RV in person before you buy it. And, and like I said, we're not going to discriminate if you don't want to buy that way, but that's the way we prefer it. Uh, like my grandfather always used to say, it's hard to take somebody seriously until you shake their hands or until you shake their hand. And, um, 
you know, folks, we've been doing this for 50 years now. We've been in business since 1968. We've been in business longer than most RV manufacturers have been in business. Um, and we've sold a lot of motorhomes, folks. In fact, that's probably a good 75% of what we sell are motorhomes, class A, Bs, and Cs. And we've got over 100 and We've got pretty close to about 160 right now when I counted this morning. Got more coming in. In fact, I think one just came in while I'm shooting this video of Class C. So, um, definitely got inventory coming in almost every day, going out every day. You know, keep in mind, thanks to the internet, you don't just compete with local buyers anymore. People travel thousands of miles in some cases to buy RVs from us because of our low prices and our haggle-free options and uh, the fact that we don't charge any extra fees attracts a lot of buyers and of course the number one thing that attracts the buyers besides the condition of the nice condition of our used RVs is the price and um, you know when you can buy a motor home for $39.9 that time you pay fees and all the other stuff at another dealer that's $50,000 when you can save eight, ten thousand dollars buying from here, it's it's easy to justify traveling here from pretty much anywhere in the country to save the kind of money we can save you. And folks, you know, we're not we're not dumb. We we, we check prices online every single day, just like you do. Uh, we have software that that tells me what this same motor home is bringing in pretty much at every almost all the every website on the internet and. We check it every every day, and we make sure our prices are the lowest or one of the lowest in the country for the same year, make, and model within 20,000 miles of what's currently on this, give or take 20,000 miles. So, folks, um, and you're certainly welcome to use Google. It's your best friend. I mean, God, y'all just don't realize the resources that y'all have that was not available to RV shoppers 10 years ago. I mean, you can literally look at every 2004 National Dolphin 5320 in the country for sale online and, and do it within a couple hours search on the Internet. You know, we do it with computer software, but compare our prices, compare the condition, um, compare the dealer. I mean, we're not a fly-by-night organization. I mean, we've got acres of used RVs out here. Uh, very few people come here and look in person and do not find something that they want to buy. This is a W-22 workhorse. I forgot to mention that too. It's just a heavier duty workhorse. Um, anyway, 600 watt inverter. Uh, give us a call. 706-965-7929. Evenings and Sundays, 423-605-6747. You can apply for financing from our website, parkwayrvcenter.com or .net, they're both mobile friendly. Um, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, get notifications every time I post a video. That's really the, the, the best way of keeping up with our inventory. Um, you know, you can call one of our non-commissioned salespeople at 706-965-7929. You can email them at sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. Of course, a phone call is always going to get faster response than an email. Keep in mind, this unit's going to be on sale on eBay and 20 of the most popular for sale websites for RV shoppers nationwide on the internet. Um, you're not going to be the only interested party in this motorhome, I can guarantee you that. It's getting harder and harder to find these low mileage motorhomes that we can sell for this price, folks. As I'm sure many of you have found out the hard way, there is a lot of junk out there and a lot of high mileage stuff that's worn out. Uh, it's getting harder and harder to find these motorhomes. There's a shortage right now of nationwide R of, of used RVs nationwide in the motorhome sector because right now people are buying motorhomes they couldn't afford them a year ago, two years ago, or five years ago. Of course, they can't afford new ones. I mean, a new gas burner starts about 150 grand now with two slides, so they're going with used. And there's not a used RV factory, contrary to popular belief. There's only a limited number of used RVs on the market at any given time. And it's not like we can call up to a used RV factory and order a variety of different ones. I mean, it doesn't work that way, folks. I wish it would. I wish we could call up and order 10 of these and 5 of these and 20 of those, etc., like the new RV dealers do. But uh, you know, it doesn't work that way. Not for what you're saving buying used over new. 
$39.9 option A, contact your sales department for option B. Um, they're both haggle-free firm. Uh, nationwide delivery is available. Financing is available with approved credit. You can apply from our website. Um, if you do apply through online, let me give you some tips. Make sure you put everything as it's listed on your driver's license uh, because we'll have to have a copy of that before we can process any loans. Uh, we'll have to uh, make sure you, you put the income that you've turned in on your taxes. If you're a business owner, 1099 owner, and you don't show all your income, folks, you're playing with fire. You're going to get caught. Don't do that. That's my personal opinion. But um, if you do do that, make sure you put the income that you file taxes on. Because that's the first thing they're going to want to see with somebody is proof of income via paycheck stub. Or if you're 1099, they're going to want to see a tax return. So no hiding that. And law, the current law, I'm not going to go into detail, but... If you turn it into a bank and you send them proof of income and it's uh, they can show that it's negligent as far as what you showed on paper to what you actually prove they have to turn you over to the uh, to the Internal Revenue Service it's a law folks I'm sorry uh, days of doing that are long gone but anyway um, so best thing to do always be truthful on your credit application don't fidge don't stretch don't lie it will bite you uh, these guys are picky because these are luxury items, and um, don't be ashamed, folks. About thirty, th about one third of the people that apply for financing get turned down because of bad credit. Nothing wrong with that. It's just, you know, it's just these banks are tougher on RVs than they are on cars, trucks, and things like that. Um, if you have any questions, call us 706-965-7929. Evenings and Sundays, 423-605-6747, and the email is sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. No commission salespeople, no games, gimmicks, trouble, or drama. We sell almost 600 used units a year. Don't have time for it any more than you do. Thank you again for watching. Look forward to seeing you soon in beautiful Ringo, Georgia.